This next episode of Overworked History is about art contests at the Olympic Games. The original Olympic Games were banned by Emperor Theodosius I of Rome in the year 393, and no major similar event took place until 1612. In Cotswold, England, the Cotswold Olympic Games were held by Captain Robert Dover from 1612 until his death in 1641. Two Olympic Games of a national scale were held in Sweden in the 1830s. Athens had their own games from 1859 to 1870, but it ended when a butcher won a contest, and a wealthier contestant protested. In the 1890s, a Frenchman and lover of ancient history, Baron Pierre de Coubertin, realized the Olympic Games could be restarted on an international scale. In 1896, he persuaded Athens to host the first modern Olympic Games. The 1900 Games and 1904 Games were both held in conjunction with World's Fairs, but eventually they became their own spectacles. Interestingly, only amateur competitors were originally allowed. In addition to the athletic competitions, Baron de Coubertin believed an art contest would help carry on the legacy of the ancient Greeks. In time for 1912 Stockholm Games, the Baron was able to gain enough support to add art contests. Five categories were created, architecture, music, painting, literature, and sculpture. Rules were put into place that what was submitted had to be related to sports or athletes. Music and literature had to be tributes to athleticism. Painting and sculpture had to depict athletes or sports. An architectural appliance could be for sporting venues. The arts contests were not immediately popular and many feared there would not be enough entries. The Baron even submitted his own Ode to Sport under a false name, and he won a silver medal. Several athletes, including Alfred Hajos of Hungary and Walter Winans of the United States, won art contests. Over the next few decades, the art contests were more and more overshadowed by the athletic games. Sometimes there were not enough entries, so no gold medals were awarded. Other years, there were not enough high-quality entries to warrant any medals. One major medal winner was John Russell Pope, who submitted a design for a gymnasium at Yale University at the 1932 Olympic Games. He later designed for Jefferson Memorial. The 1936 Olympic Games were held in Germany and became known as a vehicle for Nazi propaganda. The art contests were particularly criticized. No 1940 or 1944 Olympic Games were held, and the 1948 Olympics saw a much smaller art contest. Prior to 1952 Games, a major point of issue was raised. As mentioned earlier, only amateurs were allowed to participate in athletic contests, but professionals were entering the art contests. It was ultimately decided it would be best to remove the art contest to solve this issue, and not have been held since 1948. The art contests are a forgotten part of Olympic history, and the art medals are no longer recognized by the International Olympic Committee. Thank you.